हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सी सेट मंत्रा सी सेट मेड इजी एंड अफोर्डेबल वेलकम टू आवर डेली डोस ऑफ सॉल्व क्वेश्चंस फॉर मोर सॉल्व क्वेश्चंस एंड कांसेप्ट्स काइंडली जॉइन आवर टेलीग्राम चैनल टू एनरोल इन आवर कोर्स काइंडली विजिट सी सेट मंत्रा डॉट कॉम बोथ द लिंक्स आर गिवन बिलो इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन इन ए कॉन्फ्रेंस आउट ऑफ टोटल हंड्रेड पार्टिसिपेंट्स सेवेंटी आर इंडियन इफ सिक्सटी ऑफ द टोटल पार्टिसिपेंट्स आर वेजिटेरियन then which of the following statements is our correct this question is from logical reasoning part from sets chapter it is asked in 2019 when it comes to quantitative aptitude part maths part from sets chapter you will see one or two questions every year my friends apart from that in logical reasoning also you will see questions from sets chapter my friends so this chapter is very very important that's what i am saying mastering quantitative aptitude mathematics has advantage in other parts as well my friends okay now whenever you see a question from sets set theory the first thing you have to do is identify the given sets my friends here in a conference out of total 100 participants 70 are indians indians is one set 60 of the total participants are vegetarian so vegetarian is another set so here there are two sets my friends indians and vegetarians now please don't go on inventing the new sets that is non indians non vegetarians that's not your job kindly stick to the sets which are mentioned which are given in the problem okay indians and vegetarians clear right once you have identified the given sets the next thing you have to do is drawing the venn diagram my friends okay drawing venn diagram is very very important when it comes to set chapter venn diagram will make your job easier you can solve the problem very easily using the venn diagram my friends okay after that make use of the formulas given in the lecture clear right now let's draw the venn diagram now this is venn diagram my friends this rectangle is a universal set that means a set which has all kinds of members all the participants total participants how many 100 now in this rectangle in this universal set we have two types of sets okay indians and the vegetarians clear right now this red color circle is indians okay this whole circle and uh, this blue color circle is vegetarians okay this whole circle now this region is Indians who are vegetarians also, my friends. This region is a part of Indian circle. This region is also a part of vegetarian circle. So this region is Indians who are vegetarians also. Otherwise, vegetarians who are Indians also. Both are same, my friends. Indians and vegetarians and insects. How do we denote? with intersection my friends okay vegetarians and indians okay with intersection this region is an intersection of indian circle and a vegetarian circle clear right now this region is indians who are non vegetarians my friends okay it is a part of indian circle but it lies outside vegetarian circle so indians who are non vegetarians clear right now this region is vegetarians who are non indians my friends this region lies inside vegetarian circle but lies outside indian circle so vegetarians who are non indians clear right now this region okay both the circles this region is i union v my friends okay indians are vegetarians okay see here we have only indians indians here indians and vegetarians here only vegetarians so this whole region okay this whole region is indians or vegetarians how do we represent r in set theory with union my friends okay n is represented by intersection r is represented by union clear right now this outside region neither indians nor vegetarians my friends okay it lies outside indians and vegetarian circle we have gone through these terminologies in our set theory lecture i am explaining them here once more to make sure you are clear about them now we want indian participants who are vegetarian this area my friends okay i intersection v now venn diagram is over let's use the formula 
ओके वी नो एन ऑफ ए यूनियन बी इज इक्वल टू एन ऑफ ए प्लस एन ऑफ बी माइनस एन ऑफ ए इंटरसेक्शन बी फ्रॉम दिस आई कैन राइट एन ऑफ ए इंटरसेक्शन बी एस एन ऑफ ए प्लस एन ऑफ बी माइनस एन ऑफ ए यूनियन बी सो ही आई एम टेकिंग ए एज इंडियन बी एज वेजिटेरियन सो एन ऑफ आई इंटरसेक्शन वी इज इक्वल टू एन ऑफ आई प्लस एन ऑफ वी माइनस एन ऑफ आई यूनियन बी क्लियर राइट Now n of i number of Indians, my friends. Okay, that is seventy. Now n of v number of vegetarians, my friends. Okay, sixty. Sixty of the total participants are vegetarians. So v is equal sixty. So this red color circle is seventy. This blue color circle is sixty. This green color rectangle is hundred, my friends. Clear, right? Now I want least number of Indian participants who are vegetarian. Indian participants who are vegetarian is n of i intersection v, my friends. Okay, this value I want it to be least minimum. See, n of i is constant, that is seventy. N of v is constant, that is sixty. We don't know n of i union v, my friends. Okay, this is one thirty minus n of i union v. Clear, right? Now pay attention here. For this value to be minimum, we have to subtract maximum value of I union B from one thirty, my friends. This is constant. Okay, if you subtract maximum value of I union B, then you will get minimum value of I intersection B, my friends. This is clear, right? If you subtract minimum value of I union B, then you will get maximum value of I intersection B, my friends. For minimum value of I intersection V, you have to subtract the maximum value of I union V. Now, what can be the maximum value of I union V? That will be hundred, my friends. Okay. Observe here. When you move these two circles away, this area will be reduced, my friends. Okay. It will be getting minimum and minimum as this circle goes this side. Okay. and that this red circle goes this side this area got minimum right so when these two circles are going away that means i union v is getting maximum and that this common area is getting minimum my friends okay that's why for this value to be minimum this value to be maximum my friends okay when this value will be maximum when it will be 100 my friends okay it cannot be more than 100 right okay when uh, these two circles occupy the maximum area of this rectangle so our answer is 130 minus 100 that is 30 so at least 30 indian participants are vegetarian my friends okay this is the least value because you have subtracted the maximum value of i union v here so this statement is correct and in statement questions always eliminate the options okay one is correct so this cannot be our answer this cannot be our answer now we want indian participants who are non vegetarian this area my friends okay this area is okay indian participants because it lies inside indian circle but outside vegetarian circle my friends okay so indian participants who are non vegetarian clear right now from statement one we got to know this region white color region is 30 my friends overlapping region indians who are vegetarian okay now this pink color region will be 40 my friends because this whole circle is 70 so 70 minus 30 is 40 right now this blue color region will be 30 my friends because 30 plus 30 that is equal to 60 this blue color circle is 60 Now understand this thirty is the least value, minimum possible value of this region, my friends. It can have any values greater than thirty also. Let's look at the possibilities. Let's say this region value is forty. Now this pink color region value will be thirty. This blue color region value will be twenty, my friends. Okay, thirty plus forty is seventy. Forty plus twenty is sixty. It satisfies, right? Now let's say. This white color region value is fifty. Now pink color region value will be twenty. See, twenty plus fifty is seventy, and uh, this blue color region value will be ten. Okay, fifty plus ten is sixty. Now let's say this white color region value is sixty. Then this pink color region value will be ten. See, ten plus sixty is seventy. Now this blue color region value will be zero, my friends. 
Now tell me, can this white color region value will be more than 60? Let's say 61. If it is 61, this blue color region value will be minus 1, my friends. We cannot have the number of people as negative. So the maximum possible value of this white color region, okay, I intersection V, maximum possible value is 60, minimum possible value is 30, my friends, from statement 1. When this white color region value is maximum, this pink color region value will be minimum, my friends, that is the 10. So at least 10 Indian participants are non-vegetarian. So this statement is also correct. So our answer is C. Now tell me what is the minimum value of I union V that is equal 70 my friends. Okay see 10 plus 60 plus 0 that is 70. So in this case this vegetarian circle vegetarian set lies completely inside this Indian set my friends. Okay the 60 is completely inside Indian circle right. Now tell me what is the maximum value of I union V that is 100 my friends okay this is when minimum value of I intersection V is 30 okay so when it is 30 this value will be 40 this value will be 30 see 40 plus 30 plus 30 that is equal to 100 that means these two circles are completely filling this rectangle my friends clear right. Friends, I have taken around 10 minutes to solve this problem. These kind of problems are asked every year. At least one or two questions, my friends. Very important problem. I have explained everything in detail. If you don't get some part of it, please pause it, watch it again. If you still didn't get, please comment in the comment box below. We'll be glad to help you. You must be able to solve these problems with ease, my friends. Okay, identify the sets. Draw the Venn diagram and make use of the formulas. These words, no, convert them into mathematical terminology, my friends. Okay, Indians are vegetarian. That means I intersection V. So, please convert the wordings into mathematical terminology. Then the problem will be very easier, my friends. Okay, that is very, very important.